Hey, deep divers, ever get that annoying click in your jaw or that ache that just won't quit? Yeah, we've all been there. Today, we're going deep on something that could totally change how we deal with jaw pain, AI. We're diving into some cutting edge research that's using AI to diagnose those pesky temporomandibular joint disorders, or TMD for short. Trust me, it's way more interesting than it sounds. But first, picture this. You're at the dentist, and they say those three little words, you need an MRI. And uh, not just any MRI one specifically for your jaw. It sounds intense, right? But actually, it gives us this incredibly detailed picture of what's going on in there. It's like getting a backstage pass to see all the intricate gears and levers that make your jaw work, or in the case of TMD, not work. Exactly. We're talking about the joint itself, the little disc that acts like a shock absorber, and the condyle that's the bony part that does most of the moving. The MRI lets us see all of that with amazing clarity. Okay, so we've got our super detailed MRI, but here's the catch. Even with these high-tech images, diagnosing TMD can be tricky. It's true. These images can be complex, there's often overlap with other conditions, and it takes a trained eye to really interpret what's going on. But that's where AI swoops in with its super sleuthing abilities. Enter the AI detective. And this one's specialty, segmentation. Think of it like this. Imagine the AI is dusting for fingerprints, but instead of a crime scene, it's your jaw. Segmentation lets the AI break down that complex MRI image into manageable chunks, highlighting the key areas it needs to analyze. So it's zeroing in on the temporal bone, the TMJ disc, and the condyle, basically, the VIPs of jaw movement. Precisely. And here's where it gets really cool. The AI isn't just looking at the size of these structures, but also how they're positioned relative to each other. Any tiny misalignments could be a sign of TMD. It's like having a superpowered magnifying glass, able to see the tiniest details that even a trained eye might miss. But before our AI detective can start solving cases, it needs some serious training, right? Absolutely. Just like a human doctor, this AI needed to learn what it was looking at. So how do you train an AI to be a jaw expert? Do they get a tiny little diploma and everything? Well, not quite a graduation ceremony, but you're on the right track. It starts with a ton of data. The researchers fed this AI system a whole library of MRI images, 140 to be exact. 140 sets of jaw blueprints. That's a lot of data, but I'm guessing they didn't just show it the pictures and say, figure it out. You're catching on, think of it like this. Imagine you're teaching a kid to identify different types of birds. You wouldn't just show them a bunch of pictures without any explanation. You'd point out the beak shape, the wingspan, the colors, all the key features. That's what the researchers did here. They went through each MRI image and meticulously labeled the temporal bone, the TMJ disc, mm. the condyle, and basically they created a detailed answer key for the AI to learn from. So it's like showing the AI flashcards of jaw anatomy, mm. but instead of memorizing facts, it's learning to recognize patterns and make connections. Exactly. And the more data it processes, the better it gets at spotting those subtle signs of TMD that might not even be obvious to the human eye. It's like training a bloodhound to sniff out TMD. But instead of scent, it's analyzing shapes and positions. Okay, so the AI goes through boot camp, analyzes all this data, and now it's time for the final exam, right? How did it do? Remember those detective skills we talked about? Turns out this AI is a real Sherlock Holmes when it comes to TMD. In the study, it correctly diagnosed TMD in almost every single case. We're talking a 98.8% accuracy rate. To put that in perspective, imagine being able to catch almost every case of TMD before it even becomes a major problem. That's like an A plus in Jaw Diagnosis 101. But it's not just about catching the obvious cases, right? What about those tricky ones that are harder to spot? Like that's where this AI really shines. Not only is it incredibly accurate at identifying TMD, but it's also really good at knowing when something isn't TMD. No false alarms here. So it's not just overly sensitive, flagging every little thing. It's incredibly precise, able to pinpoint the real issues with amazing accuracy. This feels like a total game changer. Are we about to see AI dentists popping up everywhere? Hold your horses. It's not about replacing dentists or radiologists. Think of this AI as a powerful new tool in their toolkit. It can help them analyze MRI scans faster, maybe even catch those subtle signs that might have been missed before. This means quicker diagnoses, more targeted treatment plans, and hopefully a lot less of that annoying jaw pain. Okay, so no robot dentists yeah. yet. But this could still revolutionize how we deal with TMD. Faster diagnoses, better treatment, that's huge. Mm. But I imagine there's still some hurdles to overcome, right? Like, is this AI ready for prime time, or does it need a bit more fine-tuning? It's like any new tech. Got to work out the kinks before it goes mainstream. So what are the researchers saying needs a bit more work? 
One thing they pointed out is the size of the training data set. Mm. Remember those 140 MRI images? That's a great start. But to really unleash this AI's full potential, it needs to analyze thousands, maybe even millions of images. So it's like learning a language from a travel phrase book versus living in that country for a year. You'll pick up a lot more nuances with more exposure. Exactly. The more diverse the data, the better. Different ages, different medical histories, all that helps the AI become more accurate and adaptable for real world use. It's like giving our AI detective a whole bunch of case files from all over the world. The more cases it cracks, the sharper its skills become. But even with a ton of data, AI isn't something you can just build and forget, right? Yeah, yeah. It needs constant updates. Absolutely. The world of AI is constantly evolving, so this system needs to keep up with the latest and greatest in segmentation techniques. New research, new discoveries, it all feeds into making the AI even more powerful and precise. It's a bit like updating the apps on your phone. Mm. Got to have the latest version for it to work its best. Okay, so we've got this incredible AI that can analyze your jaw with incredible detail, maybe even predict future problems. But how does this actually impact you know. That's the exciting part. Imagine going to the dentist for a checkup, and they offer this amazing new scan that can spot the tiniest signs of TMD, even before you feel a twinge. Early detection like that could be life-changing. No more waiting until that click turns into a crunch. Mm -hmm. Talking early intervention. Maybe even preventing serious jaw issues down the line. Precisely. It's like that old saying, an ounce of prevention is worth a pound of cure. And that's what this AI could help us achieve. It could change the way we think about jaw health altogether. From wait and see to nip it in the bud, I like the sound of that. This has been a wild ride. We've gone from clicking jaws to AI detectives to the future of personalized healthcare. What a deep dive. And the best part is, this is just the beginning. Who knows what other medical mysteries AI will help us unravel in the years to come. It's an exciting time to be a deep diver, that's for sure. So to all our listeners out there, next time you feel that little click in your jaw, remember that AI might be the key to a happier, healthier bite. Until next time, keep exploring, keep asking questions, and keep on diving deep.